Hello everybody, Ross here, and welcome to Kings of Anglia. We're town facing Bolton this weekend. We thought we'd take a look at the top five games against them through the years. Starting at number five, we're town's 1-0 win over Bolton at Porton Road in 2013. Carlos Edwards scored an 88th minute winner as the Blues secured three crucial points and then in Bolton's five game winning streak in the league. At number 4, we have Town's 2-1 win at Bolton back in December 2012. The Blues came from behind as Dagger Freeman suffered his first defeat as Bolton manager. The home side took the lead in the first half, but DJ Campbell equalised from the spot, for Michael Tropper grabbed a last minute winner for Ipswich at the Reebok Stadium. Next up at number 3 is Town's 2-2 draw at Bolton in the dramatic playoff first leg at the Reebok Stadium in May 2000. Bolton went two goals ahead in a disastrous 30 minutes for Town in the first half. But Michael Stewart was the man that put Town back in contention when he hit a great strike late on in the first half, before he completed Town's comeback with a superb solo goal that set up a big night at Portman Road for the second leg. More on that in a minute. At number two, we have the first of the dramatic playoff games at Portman Road, as Town beat Bolton 4-3 in 1999. Four times Town took the lead in this game, but three times Bolton pulled level, and they eventually went through an away goals rule, having won 1-0 in the first leg at the Reebok. Kieran Dara and Matt Holland both scored twice that night, as the Blues missed out on the playoff final by away goal rule for the third straight year, but better was to come their own next season. At number one, we have the game that has been often called the greatest ever seen at Portman Road. Of course, we're talking about the Blues' 5-3 win over Bolton in the playoff semi-final second leg in May 2000. What a game this was. A hat-trick from Jim Gilwin, extra time, two red cards for Bolton, three penalties, and Town finally confirming their place at Wembley. Bolton took the lead early on in this game, for Jim Gilwin scored his first at night from the spot, but Town ended half-time 2-1 down. But Gilwin levelled the game shortly after the break, but again Wanderers struck back almost immediately and so it stayed until the final minutes. With Town fans almost resigned to yet another playoff heartbreak, Jim Maggio and Howard home a cracking goal to level the scores and send the game to extra time. Jamie Clapham then put Town in front from the spot and Town on their way as Martin Royce put the game to bed when he scored the Blues fifth of the night as Town finally set up a Wembley final with Barnsley and we all know how that went. So there you have it, the top five games against Bolton. Let us know any others you would include it, and let's hope it's another memorable win this weekend. I've been Ross, and I'll catch you in the next video.